I'm going to be showing you guys how to make YouTube channel art on a Chromebook with um, Pixabay Editor. So you want to press create a new image. And the width is 2560. And the height is 1440. Transparent. You can name it whatever you want, like Bougia. And you want to press OK. Now it should come up with um, this, like this. So you want to search up YouTube channel art layout thing and then you want to download it. And uh, so now you want to go to layer, open images layer. I want to get the thing, the channel art. You want to do this thing here, and you want to go over it like this, and then you want to backspace like that. So you should have it like that, and then yeah, it should look like. Now you want to now you want to look online and find a background picture for it. So. You want to uh, you want to click on that layer zero, go to layer, open images layer. Then, um, yeah. So doesn't matter. You just so um yeah. Um, now you want to search up. Like any background, so maybe like no, I'm copying the usual videos. Uh, yeah. hmm. so, you want to choose the thing that you want to do. You can grab any, but I'm using this one. Yeah. Now go to layer. Now you go. Oh shoot! You go to open image as layer. Oh shoot! Um. Wait. So yeah. Now you can do this, but. You want to go to edit, free transform, get it as big as you want it to go. Like this. So, so that's what you like. Um, yeah. You to apply the changes. And that's what you need to do for this bit. Now you want to make um, uh, a new layer right there by clicking that button. Right now, now to make it look better, you're gonna get the paint bucket out, get um, black, and paint bucket it exactly like that. Now press this button, go mode down to overlay and see how it gives it that darkness now you might want to put it up to maybe 84 depends what, what makes it look best for you really so i'll put it up to 78 maybe that looks pretty good so now you want to make a new layer like that and get get that tool and do it white And make, make like this sort of square, like like a that, maybe. And so now I want to go edit, and transform, make it you know your, your type size. Mm. I'll try and get a triangle on there, like like that. That looks good. Um. So yeah. Now what you want to do? For the background noise, you want to 
make it like that. Like a triangle shape, like that. That looks pretty good. Um. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I think that's looking good. But. Mm. Yeah, so I'm gonna try and make it like that. And that looks good. That is looking really good. Um, so that's gonna be it. Uh, so now I wanna go here. I'm gonna go. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna press this. I'm gonna put it on overlay. So it gives it that. Now you want to go to this. Press that. Go outer glow. It on um, black and then make the size about maybe 43 I guess put the hardness to 3 like that and um, actually that's not looking too bad now, now what you want to do is you want to make another new layer like get rid of that um, now, yeah, that's okay. So now you want to go here. And you want to, um, press that. Go from normal to overlay. Like so. Now go up to the shapes. And make, like, a rectangle like that. Good, that, that is looking, um, pretty good. Now, make another one right here. That's looking good. Yes, now you want to go with the eraser. There's no, like, make it look good. Erase some of that. Erase some of that. No, yeah, that, that's looking pretty cool. Now you want to go here. You want to duplicate the layer. Like that, and duplicate it one more time to get a nice shiny. And uh, you want to erase some of that extra crap there, like so. Magic, magic. Now you want to go to cooltex.com, get whatever thing you like. I like this particle one. So yeah, you want to grab that one. Pretty good. Pretty good. Now type in your channel name, and if you don't like the color red, well obviously you can choose here. I might get, so it may say blue. And that's looking pretty good, actually that sucks. Let me change it like darker here. So, let's just uh, get a drop. Now you wanna press create logo, and you want to download it now you want to go to layer open image as layer and choose that downloaded text that you um, downloaded and it'll be right now you want to go layer um writerize the layer then edit free transform and make it um as big as you want okay that looks good so now you want to go over here and you want to duplicate the layer and then edit free transform now to be like that so you want to make it go like that so it's like that looks pretty good and um yeah that looks pretty good so now press this button here and go out a glow and I'm not in a glow no and press that size bigger hardens three and that, look, that looks okay it changed so you change the hard hardness and size and it'll look at that it looks really now do that th now do that thing i told you but on those little um things there and i'll show you what it looks like when the finishing project is done there you go guys thanks for watching